These are the bandits I told you about. They came to make a profit by robbing our settlement at the dock, but it didn't pan out. I must give credit where credit is due. That bastard Tom did bolster the defenses all right. These losers have long since stopped raiding. A few years back, they made one last attempt. Klim gave them a lesson. They were so terrified, they didn't even cut down bodies of their hanged pals all over the ruins. They couldn't raid and didn't have a place to go. So they turned to trapping. They catch mutants in the ruins. Those human-like ones. Their beasts are dumb and shrewd, but strong. Quite good for dragging carts or boats on the rivers, turning wheels and stuff. They don't eat much either, so using them will save a bunch of fuel. So the bandits catch them, train them a little, and then sell them off to traders. Those come from the south a couple of times a month. They pay in weapons, ammo, rice, all the things you need for a decent life in the wild. <laughs> They visit the settlement too, mostly buying restored generators, engines, and machines. Our maintenance guys are real wizards after all. Oh, and dried fish too. So that's the region's economy in a nutshell. <laughs> but why did those trappers shoot at us? The whole city is divided between them. It took a lot of fighting to define those borders. So now they open fire at anyone approaching without proper insignia. Got it. Turf Wars, the primeval edition. Ha 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 ha! You got it. All right, we're here, Sam. Let's moor this thing and I'll show you my backup base. Cool. So, care to tell me the essence of Tom's offer? It's simple. He offers to leave you the settlement along with everyone who won't follow him. How generous. And what does he want? He wants you to deliver fuel rods for the submarine. <laughs> Come on in, Sam. Don't worry, the lift's fine. My friends and I took our time preparing this base. There's a generator on the roof. The staircase is just an emergency exit. Too many foggies in the lower floors. So the lift's not... Just have to keep that generator going. So, the guys didn't get caught back then, after all. Or if they did, they wouldn't talk. What guys? When Tom had shown his true colors, my closest friends and I decided to refuel the soul and take her to sea. The plan was strictly need to know. Only Alex, my XO, and Alex second, the torpedo officer, and Volodya, the life support guy were in. They left to recon the field and stayed in contact for two weeks. They found the fuel. And we arranged for me to pick them up in the night. But it was Klim's people who met me there. I barely escaped. Do you think they were captured? I don't know. But seeing Klim's people there was hardly a coincidence. Yeah. And we're there. Come on in, Sam. Make yourself at home, Sam. Take a rest. There's a storm outside anyway. And I'm ready to offer you just that. As soon as those reactors are refueled, my people and I will leave and never bother you again. You don't believe I'll never use this, but you'll just have to take my word on that. You know I can keep it. You've kept it so far, if we stretch the definition. But that's besides the point. Even if I believe you, don't believe Klim. Did he tell you the free bandits are working for him? What makes you say so? I have no proof. But the friends I left with went missing. Did he tell you anything about them? He said he was looking for them. I had my doubts for quite some time already. And now they're solidifying. Bolivar cannot carry double any longer. Once the fuel is here, Clem will be taken care of. Anything else? No, just that. Then we have a deal. We do, Tom. I know I'm going to regret this, but we do. You won't. A deal is a deal, Edward. 
thank you for trusting him. Sam, I don't trust him. Not even for a second. No matter what he says, I can't trust him. But... But you have no choice. Exactly. I really don't have a choice here. Ah, damn. The generator's out again. Let's go check it. Before we go, let's do something about my knee. It is swelling up already. Mm. Sure thing, Ed. Do you have anything for the pain? I don't drink, really, but I do have a crate of Molotovs. Their moonshine and fish oil should do the trick. I wish we had some food to chase the drink down with, though. Here. Wow, that's a nice surprise. All right, no point in putting it off any longer now. Cheers. <sighs> Not so bad. Here, you have some too. Are you sure? Yes, I am. Come on. Let's get it done. Oh. Oh. Disgusting. All right, I'm ready. Pull it hard. Hold on to your hat. Oh, you said it. <laughs> I don't think it worked! Let me catch my breath. And get one for yourself, too. Cheers. Oh, still awful. Okay. Pull again. Put your back into it. All right. Pulling. <laughs> 